John Prime. Boy, his intros, um, on one hand, are pretty basic, but they're also just, uh, you recognize every tune just from one or two couple of notes. Now, this is, of course, Souvenirs. Uh, one of his early songs tells a great story in the video from the 54th Street, West 54th Sessions, um, about writing it on his way to the gig. Now, it didn't show up until his second album. His first album was just chock full of incredible songs. You know, Angel from Montgomery, Paradise, uh, etc. We've got a few lessons on some of those. Got more John Prine on the way, too, because uh, it's just time. And uh, in 1972, his second album came out, Diamonds in the Rough. And this was on that. Now, it's it's uh, the original version he did, Capo with the Fifth Fret. Over the years, as he got older and more people played along with him and stuff, I uh, started dropping it to the second. So we're really taking a look more at the version that showed up on a 2000 compilation where he re-recorded this at the second fret. So we'll be doing this lesson at the second fret. And um, very simple chord progression, three chords, D, G, and A. We'll mostly be talking about the picking in the intro and, and the general progression because it's slightly um, unbalanced. So more on that as, as we get into it. The, I guess the biggest thing you've got to sort of understand is that the whole first two measures are kind of a pickup into, they are the pickup notes into the verse. So really I have the verse in my head starting with the G chord. All snows turn to water. That measure of G is like, is our beginning point. And then we'll talk about the progression. So first we'll talk about the progression, then we'll talk about the picking. And um, in just a little while you should be able to play Souvenirs by John Prine. 